the Echo Slam. Oh, there it is. Forward. There's your slam. There's the dunk. Hello. Gamer Nom is back. So for today's King's Legacy video, I've seen your comments and now we're gonna do it. Yes, the rubber fruit, we are going to unlock the gear 4th snake form or the gear 3rd in this game. So are you ready? I am so ready. I'm pumped up. Let's start. So guys, again, from level 1 to 14. Okay, level 1 to 14, you're gonna do this quest. The snake quest, the fried chicken quest. There you go, that's our first skill. But guys, we won't be using that yet. Again, we're gonna start with the snake quest, okay? Until we, we reach level 14. What? Level 14, gamer now? We have a new quest at level 10. Why level 14? I'm gonna show you why. Okay, but first, here are the locations of the chicken. There you go, the second chicken and the third chicken in the black market building. There you go, that's fast five levels. How to make it faster, just do server hopping. There you go. But you're level 12 here, gamer no? Just Guys, I'm just gonna show you. You cannot one hit your enemy yet. Check that out. So you need to like lure them first and hit them twice with your Z skill. Right? And that's kind of long for me. But when you reach level 14, again, there you go. Guys, I'm assuming that you uh, like put all your stats on the power field, right? So you just need to lure them. Lure 4. There you go. And use your Z skill. Okay, that's kind of fast, right? So do this until you reach level 20. And after that, you can start defeating Smokey. The smoky here is kind of challenging at first. Check that out. First kill. Okay. Okay. So, but when you reach level 25, you can unlock now your X skill, which is... There you go. I think this is the bazooka, right? I'm not sure, guys. Comment it in the comment section. Bazooka and first skill. And one more first skill and we're good. So I think you should... What you should do is first skill, bazooka, and another first skill. So when you reach level 30, we can start defeating Tashi. Guys, you just need to dodge this one. There you go. And you're all good. Avoid getting hit. Check that out. Almost one hit. Well, this is a sign that you need to increase your defense. Okay? So after that, when you reach level 50, we can now go to the Pirate Island. I'm going to show you a way how to uh, like grind here fast. So first, you need to grind 2. Uh, what do you call this? Clown Pirates and use your second skill or your X skill. But guys, check that out. At 200 Mastery, you, you can unlock your special. There you go, but I think this is kind of useless. Guys, just a note, uh, when you reach 260 Power Fruit, you can one-hit the Clown Pirates with your first skill. So things will be a lot faster. Okay, so when you reach level 75, okay, you can unlock your C skill. There you go. Guys, you can just one-hit combo the clown. Okay, so that's very easy. Just do it until you reach level 100. And after that, go to the sword Soldier Island. You can start grinding here by defeating the commanders. So just lure them and use either your second or your third skill. With that combo, you can uh, defeat them fast. And when you reach level 120, you can now start with the captain. One combo is enough for this boss there you go so again do this until you reach 145 and now you can start with the axe hand okay guys again i increased my defense so do this until you reach 200 and after that you can now go to the next island which is the shark island level 200 we skipped a quest we are gonna start grinding here at the karate fishman again one combo is enough Okay, there you go. So again, do this until you reach 230. And after that, move on to your next quest, the Shark Man. There's a chance that you can unlock here a sword, but we won't be focusing on that. So do this until you reach 300, okay? So when you reach 300, you can now go to your next island, the Chef Island, the Barati. 
and start defeating the dark leg. Go dark leg. Again, is one combo enough? Yes, it is. Just make sure to check the power fruit. Allocate lots of points to the power fruit. By the way, guys, at 1,000 mastery of your power fruit, you can now unlock the second, the V skill, the gear second. There you go. So your Z, X, and C, and E skill will change. That's the Z skill, longer range and kind of stronger damage. That's the X skill, shorter range. The C skill, there you go, is one of the best skills that you will get because you can use this for grinding enemies. For the E skill, the special that, there you go, a mini sorrow. Okay, so now at 350, you can start defeating this dude, the weapon man. Just use your C skill and everything will be fine. Guys, we're almost halfway there. You just need patience to finish this grinding and quest, okay? So when you reach level 450, again 450, we are dodging the lure quests. Snow Island, I mean the lure type of quests. Wherein you need to kill like more than 5 enemies, so you need to lure them. I'm dodging those kind of quests. So here, so just use your C skill and gauge the distance. There you go. Just one skill and it's enough to defeat this. So use that skill, C skill, to level up until you reach 500 and you can start defeating the heavy man. There you go, chopper. So guys, you can level up here until 625, okay? The, the difference of the uh, experience from the candleman on the next island is just 4,000. So I prefer here, but I'm gonna show it to you, the candleman. But before that, if you have 1.5 million bellies, you can now unlock the observation hockey. But gamer nom, right, we need money, right, to unlock the snake form. Yes, we can grind that later. We just need to focus here because there are lots of bullies in this area. I've been bullied a lot here. So now, for 525, if you want, you can go here. But my suggestion is just you need the observation hockey. Okay, so... Here, level up until you reach 625. Again, 4,000 difference from the heavy man, so it doesn't really matter. Okay, so when you reach 625, you need to level up here. Okay, here. Bomb man, so just use your first skill. It will explode and then use your C skill to avoid getting damage. Okay? So do that until you reach 725. And when you reach 725, you can start your grinding here with the king of sand so this is kind of challenging because it has a skill that can uh, drain all your observation hockey but it's fine guys as long as there is no other enemies here or other players or other bullies just be patient this is the longest grind i think from here this island so just be patient and everything will be rewarding so when you reach level 800 go back to the sky island why go back this is where we got the observation hockey right there you go. And you can start by defeating four Sky Soldiers. Guys, remember this area, okay? The sky Soldiers. We will go back to this area later. You just use your skill. First skill, first skill, second skill, and your C skill. There you go. Again, we are in gear second. Okay. So do this until you reach 850, guys. I forgot to record it. That's why I'm 870. But 850 is enough to level up here. There you go, just keep on defeating this until you reach level 900. And when you reach 900, you can start defeating the Rumble Man. Guys, it's your decision if you're gonna defeat this or the, uh, what do you call it, the Ball Man. It's the same, you will still reach level 100 in no, 1000, sorry, in no time, okay? There you go, so when you reach level 1000, now I think by that time, you have all the requirements. So what are the requirements again guys the requirements 1 million belly and level 1000 okay checking it now level 1000 we have 2 million belly and that's enough so first make sure that you save in this island and we are heading to the war island guys make sure to turn on your observation hockey and kind of hope that no one will attack you along the way okay so because you will go back to the sky island if you if ever you die okay so now there you go i did not cut this part so that you can see the direction so first we get past the sand island the shark island and now here we go war island 
So this island is where you start the quest to unlock your gear fourth, your snake form, or the th third transformation here. Check that out. Spawn point. Don't save there. Just talk to this girl. The beauty girl. Accept. Okay, now reset. Just reset. That's faster, right? Now you're in the Sky Island. Again, I told you, don't forget this area. The Sky Soldiers. And at the back of this uh, hill, or whatever you call it, the Red Bird. Accept. And he will give you a quest. Look for the White Man, right? Now, it's kind of easy. Go to the Sand Village. Okay. Now, in this area before, there, know this part, right? The area where the sand, the King of Sand is located. There you go. And there's a hidden passage here. There you go. Okay. See that, guys? Okay. Another one. Okay. There you go. I'm jumping just to show you that it's located here. And this area is where the white man is located. Go, so just talk to him. Make sure that you have 1 million belly. Okay. Okay, so now we've learned the snake form. Okay, so how's that, guys? Is it easy? Actually, it's kind of easy. I finished the... Again, for the questions, grinding is less than 6 hours, I guess. Yeah, it's kind of fast, to be honest. Okay, so now I'm gonna increase... The graphics to show you okay sorry about the quality of the graphics this is the second form right i haven't showed you it to you properly a while ago this is the first skill this is the x skill and this is the c skill well, now we're gonna compare it to the third or the gear fourth or the snake form here you go there you go it really looks cool okay you can <laughs> from dragon ball z anyone guys so the Z skill of this is a homing skill. So everyone in front of you, you can attack him. X skill is almost the same, but it's stronger. And the casting time is longer. The Z skill, guys, this one is so strong. If you can hit someone, the observation Aki will automatically go away. And you can one-hit anyone with this. But if they're good in dodging, like they can use their Soru, okay, they can dodge it. So this is the E skill. Now you can fly. The good thing with this is... That even though if your HP is slower, your flight will, won't get slower. Okay? Again, if your HP is slower, comparing it to other fruit users such as Dragon or the Phoenix Fruit, your, your flight will get slower. Here, no. Okay? Okay, so that would be it, guys, for request. Uh, I have a question. Do you want me to level up this? I'll make a guide with this account. Second C from... 2,000 to 3,000 or a dragon fruit user okay just comment it on the comment section again i hope that you learned from this video again to all the viewers subscribers supporters i appreciate you all again this is gamer nom and gamer nom out